Hello! Welcome, Sunbury Housewives. We are royalty today. Okay. Um, we're gonna do a little we're gonna spill, spill the, the tea. tea. Not just on the royal wedding, but on just current events. Yeah. But, um, our whole focus is the wedding yeah. since it is in what nine days? Something I don't know. Like that? By the time we release this video, it'll probably be like the day before. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Do you like our so, crowns? We got them from the Royal Vault of yeah. Wish.com. <laughs> and, and, and our, our royal jewels. jewels. Our jewels. Yeah. Earrings. Yeah, we are looking. Royal. First of <laughs> all, we sweated our makeup off because it was hot as Hades in here. And these three lights do not help? No. I'm cooling down, though. You well, yeah, you're sitting right by the air. I know. Plus, I, this water is cold. Yeah, and I have a fan. Remember this? <laughs> that goes way back. That goes way back. Okay, where shall we begin? Well, let's see. A little see. tea? A little tea. Mm. Cheerio. We should have had some biscuits, too. Some trump so crumpets. We got, we got our fancy... I said trumpets. Crumpets. Or we got our fancy um, tea china out. Yeah. Got the finest out for you guys. Christmas edition. Hey, it's the finest I got. It's even got a gold rim around it. Yeah. I'm sure it's 24 karat gold, too. Yeah, I'm sure. <laughs> so, where shall we begin? We've had a rough morning, y'all. We really have. Like, nothing went right this morning. Nothing. Nothing. Did, got up plenty early, went to get dressed, got all flustered. It's like... 100 degrees, sweated off everything that we did. Yeah. My hair was done, but then didn't have bobby pins, so I had to put it in a bun for my crown mm -hmm. to fit. And, yeah, hold. and I pulled up. That looks real. Just leave it like that. that. Poof up on there. Yeah. 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 So shall we get started on Miss Meghan Markle? I'm going to get my glasses so I can see what I am reading. First of all, oh, they are making waves. Yes, they are. I'm a little, let me, let me go with what I know already from Extra Extra because I watch it. I'm, I know that she's breaking a lot of like traditional rules like with her wardrobe and her hair like if she wears a messy bun that's like a uh, no no but they're letting her get away with it because she's like making her own rules but she's not in line cool. directly in line for the, the, queen. the queen yeah and um she's biracial which is which like is huge it changes unheard of. it changes the monarchy from here on out. Gives Michaela hope. <laughs> um, her dad is actually going to walk her down the aisle. I know that was a big issue that because they're estranged. So, but the step or half brother and sister isn't invited. No. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. And she is all over the media talking about it. She is not happy. Bitter Betty. Bitter Betty. Bitter Betty. Petty Betty. There we go. Petty Betty. Maybe if you weren't so mean to your sister, you would be invited. I don't know the deal. but Yeah, I don't know exactly. Oh, what's going on with Kanye West? What isn't going on with Kanye West? I think he just did a... Britney? He pulled a Britney. Mm -hmm. Yes, he did. And I think he 
just did a, a, what would you call it a celebrity suicide like he is complete meltdown career he said so much stuff that I don't think he can get out of it and mm. he didn't make any sense and it's just a mess and what do um what does Kim have to say about this does it say oh Kim speaks out well Kim Kim's talking about Tristan oh. and Chloe because Tristan you know he cheated while Chloe was pregnant and supposedly the new girl is pregnant too hmm, so but Chloe can't say much because what goes around comes around because his girlfriend was pregnant when she started cheating with um, Tristan so he you left her what you dish out yeah he left his pregnant girlfriend for Chloe and now he cheated and now old girl's pregnant too allegedly allegedly we don't want to be sued allegedly I mean go ahead and try we got nothing yeah literally nothing. I'm in my slippers people I'm in my I mean my stilettos with my regal gown here Yeah, you are. Yeah, I am. Shoulders back. Proper. Is this how you drink tea properly? I think you. Oh wait, you have, to bring, you have to bring this out. So if there's any spillage. And a pinky out. Uh huh. And you have to make that sound because then you know you're really like royal or fancy. Like our fancy who has a crown on. Yeah, she does. Well, I think he's a hot mess. Kim is pissed at Tristan she don't want anything to do with him she's over it I don't know how oh and there's some juice on Miranda Lambert too oh yeah I heard about because that. oh Miranda is being accused of breaking up a marriage which kind of comes back to bite her in the butt because when she was dating um Blake Blake she was actually cheating on her boyfriend at the time with Blake, who was married. Mm, and then there's rumors mm, that she mm. cheated on Blake. That's not been confirmed 100%, but Blake did have a Supposedly, tweet that he deleted. that's why they broke up. Right, but he did have a, t a tweet that he did then later delete and said, um, after learning from much criticism with the married Felker, I can finally see something up on the horizon there. Then, the XX <laughs> that they supposedly cheated on from said um i know damn good and well you were cheating on your wife and miranda was cheating on me when you two started he later added i kept my mouth shut for 13 years sorry his car karma tweet rubbed me wrong 13 years 13 years oh miss miranda so now she was dating um Another country singer, and his name just slipped out, and it's in here, and I just don't feel like looking it up. And now she's dating um, this Felker guy, and he is, um, I guess, opening for her and her things, and he's married, or was married, <laughs> or... Oh, what a tangled west web we mm -hmm. weave. But on the good side... Gwen and Blake. Blake are good, and I think they're talking about having babies. He needs to have a kid. I love Blake. He's so funny. Yeah, and she's already got what the three boys. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But um, people said I that think, was an odd match, and I think at first I thought it was too. But I totally thought it was like it no works. way, but it works. It works and for I'm, them. I'm for them now. I am for them. We're going backwards in the book. Oh, Bindi Sue Irwin. Oh, there's M Miranda's yeah. messy romance. Mm, mm, mm. Spilling the tea, people. Let me get on the front. Add team. Red carpet, amazing lace. Oh, lace is in, and look what I wore for the special occasion. You, you're looking a little like this. Shh, don't I wish? Yeah. Oh. Who no. wore it best? Neither, because that All should just be in someone's garden. Ugly. 
Holy pattern. <laughs> <laughs> you got your nerve. You'll see. Yeah. I don't like the who wore it best. No. You suck. What did she just say? Christy Teigen. Guys, it is time for Vagina, vagina Watch 2018. Because she's about to have a baby. On the Duchess going into labor. Well, she's already had the baby. Oh, but. so she was watching Kate <laughs> Middleton's mm. new baby is now fifth in line for the throne. Mm. I mean, do you have much hope at fifth in line? But and then that's what I'm saying. Meghan Markle and and Prince Harry have zero chance at this point. But they're forever wealthy, right? So I'd be okay with that. Me too. Gigi Hadid and Malik Malik. I don't know who he is, but I know who she is. Only because her mom was on Zayn Malik. That's his name. Um, I love Gigi Hadid. I love her mom. Yeah, her mom was on Beverly Hills. Oh, yeah. Real Housewives of Beverly like, Hills. I think she had Lyme disease, and then her son had it, too. Was it Orange County? No, it was Beverly Hills. Yeah, because she was on with Vanderpump. Yeah. Um, I think she is the most beautiful like older woman like I think she's so classy and so I just love her she didn't put up crap either no and I like her kids oh are they back together who was that back on Orlando Bloom and paid Katy Perry I don't know but Katy Perry apologized to Taylor Swift Oh, yes. Wow. She sent her a for real olive branch. Like a for real from Israel? Yeah, like a for real olive branch. And it said, it sent some message about... Um, maybe her meeting the Pope actually did something then. Maybe, I don't know. Time will tell. I don't know. I don't know who that is up there that got married. I don't know. That's Carrie Underwood. They got married on my anniversary. Yeah, I know Carrie Underwood. Her husband plays for um, Nashville Predators. Hockey. <gasps> oh, the yeah. situation got I'm engaged. The situation. And she's pretty. She is pretty. And he's, he's sober now. He's been sober for mm -hmm. like two years. Good for him. Have you watched any of the reunion? A little bit, but it's kind of boring to me because... They don't kick it like they used to kick it. So we don't I kick mean, it they, like we used to kick it either. No. <laughs> we all grow up. Some well, some people grow up. Well, I mean they do kick it. Don't get me wrong, but Ronnie is a hot oh, mess. Oh, I heard some deets on him. Oh yeah, he Still like the domestic team. violence type type stuff that was on. Um, Instagram live yeah oh, and yeah. He, yeah and he just had a baby with his his lady girl baby mama baby mama and that was not um what's what, what Sammy sweetheart Sammy sweetheart yeah they're done and over old news yeah but he still confessed his ever dying love for yeah, yeah. I don't know too many of those you people. Know, other than her, but... But she did take some stuff to D.C. about... Um, this is kind of interesting about the safer... Safer uh, manufacturing of makeup and things like... The things that go into the makeup. And so she did do some... Courtney... If I didn't say that. Yeah, can you read our minds? <laughs> um, she did do some stuff in D.C. and held like some kind of press conference or whatever, which was cool. Let's see. Let's see. Don't care. Nope. Don't care. No. Nope. Oh, um, J-Lo and A-Rod. I 
think they're the goofiest couple. Like, I think, like, I love she her. She always ends up with the weirdest combination of people. Yeah, like Ben Affleck. Like, that just didn't click. Even it was Mark like, Anthony. That still Oh, did, that was weird. That did not. I. And st they were always really good friends. And then they went back to being friends after their divorce. Right. It was like. I mean, kudos to them for being able to. Friends with benefits, and then you pop out some twins, and then you're like, peace out, I'm done, you know? And then she goes to A-Rod, who I think is a complete, like, he's like ditzy or something. Am I wrong? I, I don't. Like, he has no personality to me at all, not to hang with her. He, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I disagree. No. Beyonce does no wrong in my eyes. I would and not put my child through t looking like a tinsel Christmas tree. You gotta admit that's a little over the top for a little. It girl. was for the art gala. It it's art, just like the Met the Met gala that just happened. Which I I'm not Catholic by any means, but that kind of to me, if I was a Catholic, would be offensive. Um, especially like Rihanna wearing the Pope hat. Did you see that? No. I didn't watch it. Well, Rihanna wore this outfit and you know the Pope's hat is like kind of awkward yeah. shape. She wore like a bejeweled. Yeah, that's um, kind of crossing the line a little bit. And then, like, everybody was wearing, like, the Catholic crosses, like, down on their, like, Nicki Minaj had them all down on her face. And, like, if you're not Catholic, why? I don't know. To I don't. In, make a fashion I statement. I didn't understand the theme of the Met Gala this year. I loved the costumes, but I think if I was Catholic, I'd be offended. Right. But, I don't know, maybe if you're Catholic, let us know your feelings on that in the comments below. Yeah, I don't know. Not trying to start anything, just let us know what your feelings were. Because we don't... We don't really know. We, well, we don't comment on religion and things no. like that, so that's good. He's turned into, like, a kind of weirdo. Mm, don't most good celebrities. Old, <laughs> good old Jaden Smith. Um... Why is everyone flipping everybody I don't off? Know. Flipping, flipping the bird. The bird. Frustrated fire brands talk with their hands. Guess they're just tired of the paparazzi falling around, so they just flip them the bird. Future and Young Thug. I don't even know who that is, and I should. 20 years of nothing. Oh, they've been show. off for 20 years already? 98. That was the year after I got married. Hmm. I love him. He's so funny. He's he's lived a rough life, but he's funny. That's Steven Tyler. Steven Tyler, yeah. If you don't know, because you can't read her mind and can't see what we're pointing at. Go ahead, Judge. Kat Von D, like, I don't have any of her makeup, but, mm -hmm. um... She's always had those hairless cats, which... I want one. I kind of like them, but they kind of freak me out. So I'm like... They're so the ugly, they're cute. But you wouldn't have to, you know, deal with shedding hair. Yeah, but... Then you're just you painting skin. Ew. I don't know. <laughs> ew, ew, ew. Yeah, we don't care. I'm all... And George Clooney. Stars, they are just like us. They get a shape up, a haircut. Really? I didn't they think stars their did. own luggage. How dare they? They're stars. They shouldn't have to. And Serena Williams takes her own selfies. Can Don't she not all? afford someone to take her selfie for her? They load the trunk. They go bowling. They grab pizza. I mean, really, this is a snow loose, snow, slow news day for this magazine. Oh, I think this is so cute. I, yes. So, John Stamos had a baby at his age. 
he's like up there, right? Um, he's gotta be. He's gotta be in his fifties. Like even higher, than, like fifty-six or something. I don't know. He's gotta be up there because I don't know. His woman's only thirty-one. He's fifty-four. Where do you see that? Right. Oh, the very at fifty-four. So I was close, fifty-six. So 54 to have your first baby. And his I woman mean, is 31. But look at him. He looks like I know. he's he looks, 30. He's, still, mm. he's a fine piece of wine. <laughs> um, um, who cares? Don't know. Um, I do love John Legend and Chrissy Teigen. And she is about to drop that baby if she hasn't already here we go oh yeah ronnie 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 i don't condone any form of domestic violence no. not even raising your voice no i don't like it i'm not gonna deal with it and if it happens in my house i'm burning shit down like, I don't play. Like, mm. I am not playing around with that. Mm. Okay. Here's a controversial one. Oh, crap. Are we going to agree or disagree on this? Probably. Prob it's going to be. It, it, I don't know. But here's the thing. The Bill Cosby guilty verdict. Do I believe he did it? Yeah. Mm-hmm. He totally did it because there's way too many that have come people forward and way too many evidence, way too much evidence. But the thing is, like all these other people in the Me Too movement, including some that I won't mention, they're not getting court, they're not facing going to jail, except for that one sting guy. I think he is. Rom was it Romstein? Weinstein. Weinstein. Whatever. Uh, Mark, his wife does Marquesa. Yeah. Oh, and um, someone, you know, they banned Marquesa after the um, Weinstein uh, thing. And someone, I can't remember who it was, wore um, a Marquesa dress to the Met Gala. And it looked like doo-doo, like straight off the rack at Northern Lights. Yeah, just saying. But people are mad about that because she's like very... Who was it? I have no idea. I, she's like an A-list um, celebrity, but I can't think of who it is. And I don't want to say the wrong... Yeah. But, um, you know... Back to royalty. royalty. What's in a name? So they finally came up with a name for the third child of William and Kate. I don't get why do they still call her Kate Middleton? I don't know. Huh. Anyway, his moniker is Louis Arthur Charles. That's a mouthful. It fits. Especially when he starts getting, like, of Cambridge and... Yeah, like, they have all that extra. Yeah. But, I kind of like it. Yeah, it's it's dignified. Because yeah. they're sticking with tradition. Well, of course, they, like, kind of have to. Well, yeah. Hmm. In that case, yeah. Sarah Jessica Parker, something's going on with her, but I don't feel like reading it. Um, Bendy Irwin, who's so cute. I love Bendy. I loved watching Crocodile Hunter. Yeah. I remember when he died. Like, I that, called I was devastated. Work. I bawled my eyes out. I called Joel at work, and I was like, this has got to be a joke. Like, all these crocodiles, and then he gets killed by a stingray. stingray. That's crazy. But she has been with her boyfriend, Chandler, not Chandler Bang, but Chandler Powell, for 
four years. He lives in America, or did. I don't know if he's moved to Australia since, but four years, and her dad put a proof. And I heard that um, his wife has never dated again. Mm -mm. She said that that was her soulmate and that she will never date there again. There was rumors, like her and, um, oh crap, what was his name? He's another Australian actor. Oh, wow. Anyway, um, that they had dated and, like, rumors were going around that they're engaged, but that's not true. Let's see. I don't know any of those people, do you? No. I think you saw them. Oh, that's me all day. Mm-hmm. Little workout video. We'll be doing that later. Yeah. Bunch oh, of steel. the mother load. Okay, the mother of 25 fun and fabulous gift ideas to celebrate the wonderful woman in your life. Okay, Drew Barrymore has a dress. Drew, Dear Drew by Drew Barrymore. It's a polyester maxi dress. $248 on Amazon. That Apple Watch is $430. But who's going to buy a polyester dress? I don't know. Especially when it's warm out. Is that a crown? Oh, it's a crown ring. Oh. By the way, my wonderful husband sent me tulips today for Mother's Day. I got my nails done. Here we go to the end. Kylie Jenner. Oh, she went bright, didn't she? Yeah, she's been switching it up lately. Wait, didn't she just have a baby? Yeah. Look how big her boobs are. She must be breastfeeding. Well, I don't I don't know about that, but that rumor that her bodyguard was the um mm -hmm. was the da baby daddy. That bodyguard looks just like that baby. He looks like an like Asian. I mean, the Guy has to be some sort of Asian, and Stormy Webster, the baby, looks Asian, very Asian. And um, Travis Scott's mom is demanding a DNA test because that baby looks nothing like Travis. But look, that side view, either that has been photoshopped to va va voom her, or she's milking it. Well, you know they get little lifts and tucks and yeah, all that like all the time. That just doesn't look right on her body though, no. at all. That looks boring. Mm -hmm. mm, Harry oh, and the oh, it's a movie. Oh yeah, I saw that on. I want to see it. Extra. I wonder when it comes on. I don't know. Okay. Oh, it airs Sunday, May 13th. Oh. Is, that's Mother's Day. It is Mother's Day. I'll be drunk. <laughs> Any reason to drink when Nikki comes around? My um, somewhat daughter-in-law, even though they haven't... Made it official. They need to make it official and give me a little baby girl. Just saying. I have a baby girl before I do. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I might. Hmm? I don't know. I love her. And that I know. That is the weirdest outfit ever. Yeah, it is. Um, Janae Ioki. I can't pronounce her name. But she did on the VH1 Mother's Tribute. She sang a song with her daughter. And oh my god, it made me cry and cry and cry. It was so beautiful. That's somebody she don't know. Come on. And we've got... We're, we're done. Yeah, yeah, we're done. So, the little tidbits of info we got you. Hopefully everybody will sit and watch the royal wedding. I am not getting up at 4 a.m. to watch it. I will watch the rerun. I'll DVR it. Oh, that's a good idea. 
I did watch Kate and um, I did too. I did get up and super early. Prince Charles and Diana. Diana. I was up. I was a little girl. Okay. That about wraps it up. It does. So we didn't give you too much information about the royal wedding. But just to let you know, we were thinking about it. Yeah. And they're not really releasing the real full details because then we would show up. And we weren't invited. Because we got money like that. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. So, cheerio. We'll see you next time. Mm -hmm. Ta-ta. Ta-ta.